Morning Cruise, Dave, Bill, and Carmen here at the Joy FM. We're talking with KB this morning. Um, new record coming out, new music on the way, new book, clothing line, podcast. I don't know that there's any area that you're not involved in right now. <laughs> Space travel. Well, oh, well, yeah. <laughs> it's only a matter of time. Yeah, if you get that gig, he'll go with you. I will. Yeah, you got the yeah. NASA shirt on. Yeah. I'll yeah. go. I will. So um, I think most people probably... Uh, first found and know you primarily as KB the rapper. Yep. Um, I was wondering if I know you you featured on some of the people that we play all the time for King and Country, yep. We Are Messengers, Brandon Lake, uh, and that's probably about the only place that that KB has you know other than the preaching and the podcast. That's yep. where the music of KB has come to me. Yep. Although I'm considering actually picking up this new one. All right, come on. Now. I need to expand my <laughs> horizon. Almost there. We're almost there. Yeah. So what I was wondering is if we give you a quick description of the show and the three of us, how, how would it be possible to get a quick freestyle? <laughs> Do you hate right. when now people if you, ask If you, you say this? no, then that's fine. We'll move on. Um, I'll do a freestyle for you. <laughs> okay. But... It sounds a lot better on the actual song. <laughs> and given that you guys have a radio station, maybe uh, at some point. Negoti <laughs> negotiation is happening. Ah. You know? Maybe you can look, listen to the album yes. and see if you can find something. We will. We yeah, will. You, you have my yeah, yeah. word. You have my word. You know, First glory all, to glory. Many... We may just throw that one yeah. in today. Okay. All right. Yeah. Just, just, just so test it out. How many yeah. people ask you this? Is the this freestyle? Like, yeah. I mean, is, is this like your most requested? No, 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 okay, no, no. Right. Mostly people, uh, when no, I do won't? interviews. <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, it's like, you know, <laughs> you know, typically we, we, we end up talking too long and, and then there's no time to do anything else anyway. Yeah. So yeah, but I, I'll, I'll spit something for you. Okay. okay. All right. Yeah. So it's, it's the morning cruise. It's Dave, Bill and Carmen. We like to think of the show as just a bunch of friends getting together, drinking coffee, listening to music. Love and it. talking Listen about to, listening to KB. Yeah, I love it. <laughs> talking about life and Jesus and encouraging one another. That's yeah. that's our show. Yep. Um, I'll describe Carmen, and I'll let her pick. You describe Bill, and then Bill, you and describe, describe you. me. Okay. Carmen is blonde by choice and bougie. Mm -hmm. That's Carmen. Okay. Decided right. blonde. Yeah, and mm -hmm. trouble follows wherever she goes. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. <laughs> I think I'm to help him out. I'm kind of like the resident. I love Lucy, Lucy well, Ball right. kind of thing. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. all right. Kind of, yeah. yeah, but tro trouble does. If, if there's, I the only time I open my mouth is switch feet. So okay, I got you. That kind of thing. You know what I mean? So, uh, mm. Bill is our uh, nutty professor, uh, theology okay. pastor. Can't find his keys. Uh, of, tell of. Yeah. <laughs> you tell a story this is a true true thing we were talking to someone on the air yesterday or recording something yesterday dave has told a story about his wife back to school we've been together 16 17 years as a show yeah dave literally tells this story it's a great story or you know one statement story about his wife every single back to school right. year for 16 years nice Bill's like, is that right? For real? He goes, really? Is that right? Heard it for the first time. Heard yesterday. it for the what? first time yesterday. You sound like me. Yeah, <laughs> heard it for the first time. That's Bill. That is Bill. Which, where it goes. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. So you describe right. Dave. All right, so Dave, Dave, That's honestly, so funny. <laughs> Dave's a true blue brother, for one thing. True blue, steady Eddie. Okay. Yeah. Can't um, ride limit all. And his, fa but but the other side of Dave that you need to understand is his favorite phrase is "get off my lawn." Yeah. <laughs> he can be a little grumpy. So so he has if he opens his mouth he's going to bottom line it. Yeah. Got you. It's going to come right down sound, to the bottom line. He's going to sound like he's irritated. He's really not. Yeah, yeah. But he sounds like it. Yeah. It's yeah. passion. You understand that. <laughs> I understand that very well. I understand that very well. Yes. Yes. All right. Okay. So that's that's, that's us in a nutshell. <laughs> Have we got anything over there? No? <laughs> Nothing in the way of music that could help him out? No. Nope. Okay. Oh, All right. We don't? I was trying to. My laptop's dead. Oh. Oh, man. Oh. Yes. Understood. So am I to respond to that? Well. Uh, it, 
it, he's basically saying, can you come up with a rap now that you know? Oh, what you want me to make something up like on the spot? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that thing went we, way <laughs> over my head. <laughs> We had a we had a beat. For I you thought too, we were just we, getting to know each other. No. I'm so sorry. I was like, man, this is just the intro to the. the no, 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 no. So that's a tall ass. I, so I I would I, do that so poorly that yeah. nobody nobody in your audience is gonna want to hear me ever again. <laughs> All right. I thought I was just gonna do just a, a, a like a, a, a just a, a rap like like a. Do so it. We have. I can do that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I thought I just do just it. do a a, a, yeah, a yeah. rap. Yeah. So no more freestyling. That even sounds weird. A rap. What is that? Uh, yeah. Do a rap. Typically, people would say, "Okay, I'm so sorry. That's Our right. worlds are converging." So, <laughs> yes. In, in 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 typically when when uh, in hip hop kind yes. of the world, when they say come do a freestyle, oh. it's like a verse you have. <gasps> that you then just do it to a beat or do okay. it live, that kind of thing. Mm-hmm. So I'm so sorry. That's, That's okay. all right. That's I was, right. I, I got to be better than that. No, 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 no. Well, I, know, I don't we, think the problem is you. I didn't know where you. y'all were going. I was like, <laughs> <laughs> we were just getting to know each other here. I was going to say, well, hey, you know, okay, I, I'm no. also very forgetful. And, uh, <laughs> anyway, he looked at me and goes, am I supposed to respond to that? Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Well, here's the thing. We told you at the front, the elephant in the room is, we are not your target audience. Yes, so, yes. Hey, we're this, getting this, we're I think converging. I am. This I is, think I am. I'll listen to you preach all day long. I we, like it. We're we're trying to merge these two worlds. Understood. So help us out in any way you can. Let, let me just just just, this is, this just yeah. give yeah. people a little. A little. <laughs> yeah. All right. So I got I got this here. Um, new rappers that sure to blow turn out to be drug addicts with studios. If you have to pop pills on the usual, then that paradise ain't really cool, yo. If your world is that flame, then why are you always trying to escape? That's Instagram flexing. Because those money phones or money loans in your real life is you coming home to an empty house and a heart of stone. Bad chicks are super savage for a bigger burke and she moving on. Oh yeah, you making moves, but these folks don't really love you. The industry only love dudes that they can use, don't get confused. In interviews, I don't tiptoe. Go and check on my info. His glory is simple. I'm riding around with that tempo. They call me liberal. They call me conservative. They call me charismatic and reformed too. All I know is my wife happy and Jesus love me. I got nothing left to conform to. Mm. Ooh. Yeah. That's what we needed. Yeah. Right. That's what we needed. Oh, that's so here's perfect. a question for you. On the back end of that discussion <laughs> and all of it, what could we, this is a serious question, what could we as the Morning Cruise, as the Joy FM, uh, we've got LF, the our, our 24-hour stream that's rap and hip-hop, what can we do to partner with KB to impact our community? Wow. Mm. Good question. Let me just say this quick caveat and then I'm gonna answer that. I cannot overstate how powerful Christian hip hop is in the lives of young people. Mm. I think people uh, across the spectrum love the love Christian hip hop, mm. but in those ages, myself here, I mean the Dream Hudson is behind me right now from Southside Rabbi. Uh, both of us now over 15 years strong walking with Jesus, lovers of theology, lover, lovers of God's church. Uh, and the spark of that flame was Christian hip hop. Somebody mm. gave me a Christian mm. hip hop CD mm. and I heard the gospel in a way I had never heard it before mm. in my life. And I believed on Jesus and I've been walking with them ever since. Mm. I, I know that the church has resources and I really would hope that they would see that there's a kingdom investment in Christian hip hop, uh, that they can lean into for the good of revive for the good for a generation. Mm. Uh, not to mention the, you know, as we live, I mean, this music is like discipling people in front, discipling people from a distance. Uh, you still remember that hip hop is, the the wordiest genre on the planet, so yeah. that so you're able. You preached us a sermon just a minute ago. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. amen, in, in amen. Yeah. So you're able to pack yeah. so much into a song that you can't do in any other genre. Mm-hmm. And I think just for the sake of of evangelism missions, I don't think the first question. I said this at momentum. I don't think the first question is how does this make money. It's are we impacting this world for the kingdom what's the best ways that we can do that we'll talk about that first then we then we'll talk about how we fund it 
I, I just want to see some more priority that people mm. would see, mm. you know, as folks are riding through the city right now, listening to the Joy FM, which, you know, it's an honor to be on the show. I see that y'all bumper sticker everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, you know, but th- their kids are in the car. Their kids are in the car and and uh, and 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 they're young families. My wife was just pointing out to me this morning. We went to drop off our kids for school this morning, and 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 it, pretty much everybody there is our age in terms of the the parents. We're all at a similar place in life. Christian hip hop is one of those genres, among others, but it's one of those genres that helps people to persevere, helps bring them to Jesus, and helps them to persevere. And I just really want people to see the spiritual ROI. Mm-hmm. And investing mm-hmm. in Christian hip hop, mm-hmm. you know, good. so there's that um, ways in which you guys can partner um, is in, in subtle, subtle or, you know, you know, more object, more uh, sort of straightforward ways, uh, letting people know that we're out here. I mean, even if it's something that doesn't fit the format of a particular radio station, I understand radio stations have formats. Uh, stuff like this mm-hmm. opens the door. Someone's mm-hmm. going to, from this interview, mm-hmm. find me mm-hmm. and then Spotify mm-hmm. and Apple Music and Tidal and YouTube are going to suggest a bunch of other people mm. from from them looking up, looking at me, and they may find that artist that becomes, mm-hmm. uh, uh, you know, a, a kind of you know, emanation of the voice of God in their life, mm-hmm. even if it's not me. Mm-hmm. That's what happens to everyone in CCM, you mm-hmm. know, mm-hmm. You, you, you discover artists through other artists and mm-hmm. uh, Christian hip hop in a lot of ways has been on the outside of that. And if, if, if any ways that you all might leverage and resource to make people aware of us, the awareness enough is almost enough because mm-hmm. I am confident if people know, if they find out it's that there's something powerful that they'll come into contact with that they'll, they'll want to support. Good. Yeah. <music>